Fat is one of the essential nutrients indispensable for the growth and activity of the body. Usually we add fat through cooking oil. There are two main types of fats. Saturated fats, high in pork, beef, chicken, duck, butter, cheese, whole milk. Unsaturated fat, many in plants such as soy, sesame, peanut, olive, sunflower. Excessive use of saturated fats increases the risk of obesity, cardiovascular disease, diabetes, including gastrointestinal cancers. Vegetable oil contains high levels of unsaturated fats, which are good for the body, and provide essential fatty acids such as linolenic acid, a good acid for the formation and growth of brain cells and sagittal cells. Open eyes in children. For adults, these fatty acids help convert blood cholesterol into the liver to convert into derivatives that do not block blood vessels, thus helping to prevent the risk of atherosclerosis, arrhythmias and thrombosis. This reduces the risk of myocardial infarction, stroke, and hypertension. According to the recommendations of the World Health Organization WHO, and the Ministry of Health, energy from fat should account for between 15% and 25% of the total energy supplied from daily diets. Do not use more than 4 teaspoons of cooking oil per day. Sesame oil, gak oil, peanut oil, soybean oil, sunflower oil, olive oil have high nutritional value. However, Coconut oil, palm oil contains high fatty acid content, so should be limited. For children under the age of 5, the body is growing fast so it needs a diet rich in fat, which accounts for 35% minus 40% of daily energy needed, to perfect the nervous system, especially arachidonic acid. To ensure the supply of fat to babies, parents should supplement 1 to 2 teaspoons of cooking oil or fat, which can alternate one serving of fatty oil. Note: Some imported cooking oils are only used to mix the salads. If fried, it is not good for your health, especially for young children. Please read the manufacturer's instructions carefully.